My name is Joel Gatehouse and I'm an actor and uh, divisor and, um, yeah, and uh, director and I work mostly within uh, physical theatre and devised theatre uh, and my training is in, uh, is in physical theatre and uh, collaborative approaches. Uh, but I also work as a technician as well on the side. A collaborator, yeah. Uh, I saw it um, on Facebook through, through friends and uh, I thought it looked really interesting. I was very attracted to the fact it was free and um, I thought it would be an excellent um, opportunity to uh, continue my practice, continue my work and um, meet um, meet some new possible f uh, future collaborators and um, and and I suppose uh, to get the creative juices flowing okay. really yeah um, I've read about hackathons um, in, and uh, I've had friends who've worked in sort of uh, yeah in, in tech companies and things like that and, and being involved in, in, in things like that but um, uh, I've never personally participated in one. I, I, th I think it's, it's been an interesting approach and uh, very different from, uh, from my experiences of looking at what something like this might be. Uh, ordinarily I would look at this as being like a, a research and development opportunity or work, workshopping uh, process of creating something. Um, this I suppose is just starting to look at a different, um, different culture, trying to find a different relationship between participants, it's slightly more hungry, slightly more condensed, slightly more pressured environments, I don't know, it's, it's been really interesting, it's been really interesting, uh, I'm not sure, um, yeah, I'm not sure what, what practices I will take from it and continue? Oh, yeah. Uh, well, it's working with strangers. Um, it's working with people that I don't know, I've never encountered, I have no shared necessary working language with. Um, uh, there's some commonalities, but there's a kind of feeling out process that's, that's usual. Usually I work with people that I know and that I have worked with on various projects or I've got to know over a long period of time. Uh, so that's very different, um, and uh, yeah, the kind of uh, the lack of a kind of project leader as well is quite different. This has been very kind of um, there's no definitive kind of director or, or something like that. So it's it's a really open collaborative process, which is not something that I typically do. But yeah, I really enjoyed the. Um, the structures that were put in place to kind of focus the mind, focus the work, focus the intentions, um, asking things to be done now when they've barely just started. It, it, for me, it's interesting because it forces you to answer things, forces you to go with your gut um, and, and makes you make decisions that you maybe would uh, put off and you just have to make a choice and go with it. And I've, I've really appreciated that. Yeah, I think um, there's definitely some things that I'd like to take away from its structures, for example. The idea of pitching something with a, a specific um, intention for that pitch. Uh, an artificial construct just to kind of get things going. Um, um, competition, I think, is sometimes a bit of a dirty word within arts community mm -hmm. and so I think actually it's, it's refreshing to see how that competitiveness, that kind of um, push to kind of like be the st strongest, be the thing, can be a really, um, really useful uh, tool mm -hmm. to push things forwards. And I think, I'm not sure yet what of those I will take and put into my practice but um, but I think it will be 
I think it will be that kind of a, a re-evaluation of that competitiveness, that kind of need for a for a, to top something else, to drive you on further, faster, quicker, stronger. I don't know. Yeah.